John, what's the verdict on the uh, runouts this afternoon? Yeah, another good uh, workout for the boys. Two teams got about uh, 60 minutes in their legs, which is the main thing. Obviously, it's all uh, about the physical uh, aspect of the game at the moment in pre-season. But, you know, delighted to score a lot of goals as well. Both teams uh, were very clinical, uh, which was great. So, uh, it's an, uh, all round very pleased with the, the run-out. How pleasing is that to see, sort of, that the work that you're doing in training is paying off in, in what we're seeing in the final third and the number of goals that have been scored? Yeah, the lads are working their socks off, you know, since we came in from day one. Their attitude of the group has been fantastic, which obviously I said a lot last season and, you know, that's continued coming back and, you know, everyone's buying into what we want to do. You know, we want to be um, a really exciting football team to watch and um, as well as being very difficult to play against. You know, it's disappointing to concede a couple of goals late on, um, but, you know, overall, um, you know, we're heading in the right direction. We saw at tail end of last season how solid we could be as a group. Is there an emphasis this pre-season on giving a little bit more in that final third, being a bit more creative and scoring more goals ultimately? I think scoring more goals for sure. You know, I, I still think we created a lot of chances last season without being clinical. So you know, we can't get carried away with that. Uh, it's important that we improve our numbers in the final third. Yet, yeah, but it's also important that we, you know, we know our bread and butter, and that's to be hard to play against and and, and keep clean sheets. You know, so uh, it's getting that right balance. And you know, there's a lot more hard work to to go uh, another four weeks to go we have a good week uh, next week in Austria now and um, you know we'll keep working on them areas we need to improve on it's not just goals but we had goal scorers as well today lots of them as well again is that something that's important going forward that there's that's spread across the team goals yeah it is it's important everyone uh, plays a part you know we've looked at the numbers and what we need to be successful uh, next season and, and we've also looked on, on where the goals have got to come from so it's great that you know different players have scored today and, and different um, areas on the pitch as well are you sensing that the group individually are really keen to catch your eye in this pre-season? Yes, we saw it at times last year, but it is a bit of a clean slate and a chance to really show you what they can do going forward. It is, but there's not that many different players from last season. Obviously, there's a few coming from loan, but then the 23 is coming up. You know, the, the squad is very small, um, you know, and, and we need to improve that. We know we've got to bring in uh, good quality to help the rest of the group. So, you know, that's something we're trying to do. Uh, but everyone who's trained so far, be the, the oldest boy to the youngest boy, of, of the, their attitudes have been sensational. And, um, you know, it has to be like that if we are a, a small, tight knit group. You know, every person is going to play a big part in, on our. On our uh, success next season. Is that recruitment process still a work in progress at the moment? Yeah, it certainly is, but I know they're working their socks off to, to get the right characters in, the right players in, and you know I spoke about coming in uh, last season and um, keeping the team in the league, and then I want to help them build this fantastic football club into a really competitive championship team again, and um, you know hopefully with the help of um, more players coming in we can do that. Austria awaits, what are you looking for from the week ahead? Another uh, tough week of fitness work, you know, getting our, our points across on how we want to play as well. So it's all about fitness uh, over the pre-season and it's a good, a good week now to, to get that bonding together with the staff and the players as well. And, um, you know, it should be, uh, should be good fun. It's hard work on the pitch, but is there also a, a sort of part of it that is quality time together off it as well? Yeah, pre-season's all about uh, bonding and, and getting to know each other. You know, as I say, you know, um, with the young boys coming up as well, it, it'll be good to, to see how they cope with the, the pressure and the uh, intensity of, of going away on their first trip with, with the group. So, listen, the, the, the players we've got here are a really fantastic group of players and we're all looking forward to going away next week and learning a, a bit more about each other and, um, you know, getting ready for when we come back. How good a game to look forward to at the end of it as well. I think we've had two decent tests so far. Will that be a step up in, in the quality of opposition, do you feel? Yeah, it's important that we keep uh, testing the boys. You know, the, uh, the the quality has to be better, the teams that we're playing against. You know, the next game coming up will be a difficult game, we know that. But, you know, one we'll be ready for. We can try a few uh, different things and what we're looking at as well. So, again, the most important thing is that we come through it with no injuries and, and we get our fitness in the legs.